Good morning, Richland High School. Thank you for viewing Ramp TV. Today is Tuesday, October 29th. Today's lunch is cream chicken over biscuit, chicken fritters, meat lovers pizza. There will be a, no math tutoring after school today. High school reading team meeting. There will be a high school reading team meeting in the library today after school until 4.30. The Scholastic Quiz. Congratulations to both Varsity and JV Scholastic Quiz teams for the win over Penn Cambria last night. Practice today and Wednesday this week, right after school until 4.15. Girls Soccer D6 Championship Fan Bus. There will be a fan bus for the Girls Soccer District 6 Championship game today. There will be a charge of $3. Sign up in the main office before noon on Tuesday. Senior High Forensics. Attention to Senior High Forensics team. There will be no practice today. Practice will resume on Thursday from 3 to 4.30. Homecoming pictures. Homecoming pictures are in, and you can pick them up in Ms. Riggle's room, B108, periods 2, 3, 4, 8, and 9. My nose is so itchy. The sophomore class members are reminded that Apple wishes orders and money are due to Ms. Gruss by Monday, November 4th. Sad. Sad Safe Sofa will take place at the senior night football game on November 1st. For a chance to win your seat on the comfy safe sofa and free food from the concession stand, tweet why you are drug free to at Richland S or Richland Sad with the hashtag RHS Sad Sofa. Everyone safe, so. safe sofa. <laughs> Everyone who participates with a valid answer will have their names put into a drawing and. A random winner will be chosen. Submit your tweet by October 31st. Be very creative. The class ring orders. Attention sophomores, juniors, and seniors. What a great way to show your school pride and spirit. It's time to order your class ring. If you have not received your Jostens class ring design kit, pick one up in the main office. Place your order online or post date your mail-in order by Friday, November 8th, 2013 to take advantage of the savings in your design kit. Congratulations, Cross Country. Congratulations to Tori Kosius, Julius, Dr. J. Eckroth, and Andy Murtha for their success this past Saturday at the District 6 Cross Country Meet. The three runners have qualified for the state championship and this wait, meet this Saturday, November 2nd, in Hershey. Good luck to the Richland runners and hurry back. Ha ha. Freshman class. There will be a freshman, freshman class meeting on Friday, November 1st in the theater period 6. Technology Student Association, TSA, meeting the Richland Technology Student Association, TSA, will hold their first informational slash sign-up meeting tomorrow from 3 to 4.30 in room E111. The first TSA workday will be held on Thursday, October 31st. TSA workdays will be held every Monday and Thursday from 3 to 4.30. Hey. I'm a TSA member. The Technology Student Association is an international middle and high school student organization, 150,000 strong, with regional, state, and international conferences. With competitive events, from prepared presentation to fashion design, from music and video production to web development and programming challenges, and leadership opportunities geared toward preparing you for anything from public speaking to a life of leadership, the TSA encompasses nearly every career and area of interest in today's world. Join an international organization of middle and high school age students who are interested in the same things you are. In TSA you'll learn about careers in technology, business concepts, meeting procedures and public speaking, communication principles, information exchange, and just generally the skills that successful people have to make. So get a head start on your future. With the experience in networking, TSA can help you develop. Compete on regional, state, and international level in a huge variety of competitive events. In fact, between the middle and high school levels, the TSA offers over 60 of them. No matter what you're interested in, TSA has a competitive event that will help you develop the skills, the networking, and the experience Necessary to jumpstart your career and give you an edge in today's global marketplace. Learn to lead your peers, your profession, and your world. 
Develop the leader in you through a TSA Leadership Academy. Learn to lead formal meetings and procedures. Whatever your future brings, TSA will help you get there. And if that's not enough, wait till you see where you'll be competing. Aside from the regional and state competitions, you could have the opportunity to travel to the National TSA Conference, a conference that's taking place all over the continental United States in some of the most renowned business and conference centers in the nation. Places like Chicago, Illinois, Nashville, Tennessee, Dallas, Texas, Orlando, Florida, Denver, Colorado, and Baltimore, Maryland, just to name a few. So what can you do? Get involved. Talk to your state advisor. Join your school's chapter or start your own. You can find out more about TSA at our national website, www.tsaweb.org. We'll see you there. This is Bailey Sandin, a junior TSA student. What do you like most about TSA? I like most about TSA is challenging myself and meeting new people. Why would you recommend someone do TSA? Um, it looks really good on a college application. It's a lot of fun meeting everyone and like just doing TSA is an overall great experience. What do you do during free time at competitions? Well, it depends. At regionals, we usually plug in like a laptop and watch the movies, but at States, there's so much more to do. I mean, there's carnivals, and you can basically do anything you want. It's a lot of fun. This is Mr. Hutzel, TSA advisor. What do you like about advising Richland TSA? I like our interaction with students and seeing them succeed at a lot of different technology events and uh, getting interested in careers that they may pursue in the future. Why would you recommend people do TSA? Uh, first of all, it's fun. Uh, our students have a blast. They meet new people in Richland and also at other schools. Uh, they, it gives them a chance to be part of a national organization, which is something very unusual uh, for students that are in middle school or high school. And it's just overall a great activity for them to be involved with. And when does TSA start? TSA starts next Wednesday, which is uh, October 30th, and we will hold TSA workdays on Mondays and Thursdays each week from 3 to 4.30 in room E109 and E111. And can you tell us about your pins? Uh, these pins are, they show how proud I am of all of my students uh, here at Richland and how well they did at national competitions. Uh, each one of the square pins, they're from students that placed in the top 10 in the nation in their events. And the other pins are just from different places we've gone for national competitions. Thank you. This is Kayla Galapi, a TSA student, and this is Brendan Reger. Hi, Kayla. Hey, Brendan. I heard you're in TSA and I would like to know more about it. TSA is the Technology Student Association. In it, you can go to different competitions and compete in a variety of events. Mm. Who exactly can join TSA? Any student in grades 7 through 12. There's middle school TSA for grades 7, 8, and 9, and high school TSA for grades 10, 11, and 12. Okay. What kind of events are there in TSA? You can do a variety of different events. You can do photography events, essay writing, video making, robotics, dragster, basically anything you can think of. Cool. And will this help me in my future, and if so, how? Yes. It will. Many students have gone into jobs that related to their TSA events later on in life, and not only that, it looks very impressive on a college application that you competed in TSA. Very cool. Yeah. Maybe I'll stop by sometime. You should. Pennsylvania TSA, the Technology Student Association. Here are examples of events from last year's state competition. Materials Process. Inventions and Innovations Pennsylvania Snapshot and Go Green Manufacturing Middle School Event. The winter sports sign-ups have begun in the athletic office. Have a fantastic day and go to the girls volleyball game tonight. There's their playoffs. What is your greatest fear? I am afraid of falling off a roller coaster, like coming down off a hill and then falling off of it. What's your 
biggest fear? Um, probably chickens, the way they gawk. What's your greatest fear? All, all of you. I hate spiders. Cooties because girls are scary. <laughs> I hate snakes and spiders. Uh, I'd probably say being broke because I'm really not afraid of anything. <laughs>